All right, guys. Welcome back to another video on what I feel like doing. Today we are going to be ranking all the Plants for Zombies 2 plants. And for this ranking, I will have S through F, including E tier. As well as N, A for ones that aren't really applicable. Such as, what's a good one? Hot potato. That one isn't really, you're not really able to rank it. Since it's got a job that isn't killing zombies, really. Or stone. And then don't own. There's going to be something like shadow mint, I think. Concealment. Red butter lettuce. Gum nut. Youth seeker. Hocus crocus. I'll tell you what. But all these are done. I'm also five away from owning ice. But five seeds. So, yeah. This. <laughs> Is gonna be a little bit long. So, first up, ailment. I do own ailment. Now I'll have to say it poisons across the board. Easy A tier. Very easy. Aki. I've heard a lot of people hate on Aki. I don't actually hate it. I'd say B tier. I think it's okay. Like better than okay. It's good. Apple mortar, okay. I've not be not the I do own apple mortar. I have to say apple mortar is one of the it's a B tier. It's right next to Aki. I say. Costs a bit more, does some good damage. It's not horrible. I don't think it's good either. Like really good, I mean. Banana launcher. That is a perfect example of a C tier. Maybe D tier. No, C. Because it's just not exactly one of the best. It, it, it's good, don't get me wrong, but that's weighed down by not only the cost, but because of the cost, you have to like focus your whole strategy for the level on it. So, yeah. Blastberry Vine. I just don't ever see myself using Blastberry Vine. I do own it, and it's, uh, it's okay. It's not the best. It's splash damage is pretty nice though. I'm pretty sure it has splash damage at least. Bloomery. Easy D tier. Not very it, it hits three zombies at once, don't get me wrong, but like they're just way better options. Bloomery is good at the start, but other than that, it's just not really worth it, you know. Blooming heart, do not own. Heart is good though. Blover. That's more of an NA. You can't really rate that. And yet it blows away, but like, you're really gonna compare that to a P shooter. Bombardment. That is an S tier. Three cherry bombs across the board when you use it. That's that's an S tier. That's really good. I might think ailment too, but like, I don't know why. I think just bombardment is better. Bonk Choi. See? Bong Choi is an E tier. People are like, Bong Choi is so good. It just isn't, though. I don't think it is. A lot of things are better. It has basically no health either. It's bad. Moon Balloon Flower. E tier. It is not good. I mean, yeah, that Doom Shroom Cameo is it's good. It's cool. But it's just not that good, dude. I see Darted Choker. I'm just going to do that. <laughs> Um, Bowling Bolt. See, I do like Bowling Bolt. It is pretty good. I'm thinking B tier. It's not amazingly good. It's just kind of good. I do have it at level 3 though, so keep that in mind. I do have it where the blue ones spawn the most. <laughs> Cabbage Bolt. E tier. I'm not one of those guys who thinks Cabbage Bolt is worse than Pea Shooter. I just don't. It's not that bad. I don't get what people are so crazy about. Uh, enlightenment. I'll just put that there. I just gotta put a few of those in there. Cactus. I like cactus. Cactus is at least, is it B tier? I think I'd say it is B tier. It's not super good, but it is good. It's kind of good. Yeah. 
Call of Power. Call of Power, you need like a group of them. To have it like worth it, you know? Um, I'd put that in, I'm, I'm contemplating between C tier and B tier here. I'd say B tier. It's, it's good. It can hypnotize anything. Celery Stalker, instant E tier. I don't like it. I think I should move Bumble and Thar up one. Like, compared to these guys, it's good. Charred Guard. Oh yeah, Charred Guard. You already know. One of the best stars. Right up in A tier. In Arena, it regens for some reason. <laughs> when paired with Blover, it's pretty good. Cherry Bomb. B? Or A? I'd say it's A tier. You can't go wrong with Cherry Bomb. Chili Bean, that is a good one to start with. That is a B. Good starter. Just instantly kill a zombie. Pretty good. Chomper. I'd say D tier. Because, like... It's Chomper, you know? It looks sick, don't get me wrong. But, eh. Citron. I don't like Citron, it's E tier. Citron's bad. In my opinion, at least. I don't like it. Too expensive for too little. Same with Coconut Cannon. Too expensive for too little. I do like its mini game though. Cold Snapdragon is S tier. You already know. Cold Snapdragon is so good. Containment. <laughs> Um, where would I put contain them? I'm thinking B tier. Yeah, there's a lot of B tier. Um, I'm thinking B tier. It's it's good. It freezes all zombies for like a second. That's pretty good. I see gold leaf here, and I'm just gonna put that in N A. All right, dandelion. I own Dandelion. I know, I know other people don't really. Oh, that is a C tier, actually. Dandelion is a good C tier. Or B tier. <laughs> Another B tier. Is it really? I think it's a B tier. Yeah, B tier. I, I like Dandelion. Daisy Chain, that's a C tier. It's mid. I don't think it's good. Dirathodil is an A. It's like a pea shooter, but it blows away imps and flying guys. Like the lead zombies. It's pretty easy. It's pretty good. Um, Dusk Lobber, that's an A tier. Like, Dusk Lobber is pretty good. It's strong. It's not S tier, but it's still A tier. See, here's Electric Current. It's so bad. <laughs> like, buy this gem plant last. If you're gonna buy any electricity, then shaman. I don't want this. Um, electric pea shooter. How long is this? Oh my gosh. Okay, gotta keep going. Electric pea shooter. That is. I'd say this is a C tier. No. B tier. It's strong and is a little expensive. 200. That's also what's weighing Aki and Apple right there. They're expensive for how really good they are, you know? If it was 150, it'd be good. Electric Blueberry. Bro, Electric Blueberry is so mid. People who say it's good don't know what they're talking about. It is so mid. Dang, there are a lot I don't want. Like, what even? I don't know what that is. I think that's the mid. By the way, I don't own. I do have opinions on a few of these, like Darta Choke, Ice Bloom, Explode on that. It's just I don't own them, so my opinion on them would be bad, you know?
All right, EMP don't can't really rate that. Endurian is the definition of mid in this game. Like, nah, I'm not gonna use it. They're just better options. Enforcement. I'd say Enforcer is on the same level as Containment. It just shrinks a few random zombies. Escape route. D tier. No one really uses Escape route. <laughs> yeah. Fire P Shooter. C tier. Just better options, honestly. It costs a lot too. 175, same as Aki. Aki attacks every single zombie except Parasol, though. Fire, Peace Shooter, doesn't even have splash damage. Fume Shroom. That is a C tier as well. I mean, yeah, there's there's piercing, but like, eh, It's not good piercing. Garlic is straight up F tier. These two only work when together, and they're both F tier. Yeah, this should be telling you something uh, oh, I just see puffball and pyramid here let's just put those there don't own hot date either ghost pepper oh that's a that's an a tier or s tier it's it's like the one of the best gem plants it is so good 75 sun for that oh my gosh it's like 1.5 sun for this it is so worth it if you want to get this on halloween it's like 100 gems it's really good gold bloom yeah s tier it's super good it's just so good it's so much sun great buster can't really rate that um grape shot it's just a better cherry bomb honestly Still an A tier. Because Heat Seeker is just a better grape shot. <laughs> Pretty sure. I forgot if Heat Seeker explodes or not. I could check right now, but nah. Oh my, what even is this? Oh, um, Grimrose. That is a D tier. It's not good. It just straight up isn't. I remember thinking it was so good, and then I realized, dang, this thing's kind of mid. 75 sum for that. See, Ghost Pepper is way better. Guacanal is a D tier. Or C tier. I don't really remember. I just know it doesn't do that much damage. I'd put D tier. I don't really like using them. At least to me, it feels like he doesn't do that much damage. Holly Barrier. This is C tier. Um, maybe B tier? Yeah, B tier. <laughs> He's good. He's good. I don't really... It's kind of a little, like, complex, you know? Homing Thistle. D tier. He's like so expensive and it's not even that good. Hurricane. Oh, I love myself some Hurricane. Best dollar. Blow him all the way to the back and it freezes them. It makes them cold. Oh my gosh. 75 sun? Or wait, 100 sun? My bad. For 100 sun? For only 2 sun? Put all the zombies there? You best believe I love myself some Hurricane. Hypnoshroom, that's an E tier. I don't ever use Hypnoshroom. Don't think I ever will genuinely use it. Iceberg, people are like, oh my gosh, Iceberg West. I don't. It is good, but it's a B tier for me, dog. I don't. It's free. But like, hey, I don't use it. And it's hitting you can't really write. Empire is a better chili bean. Honestly. It's free, and it has a way faster reload, I'm pretty sure. You do need two to take out one zombie, but that's fine with me. That's more stalling. 
infinite. Uh, it's like a C tier. It does respawn, but like at what cost? You know, it's so. It, it's like seventy five cent, I think. But it's so weak. It's just so weak. You cannot rate Marigold, bro. That thing is only in the Zen Garden. Intensive Carrot. Um. F tier. I don't think I need to say anything if you played the game and used him. 100 sun. So I can revive 50 sun or yeah or something. No. Jack o' Lantern is A tier. Not S tier. A tier. It is really good. It blows the guys. It's really nice. That blows the guys. You know what I mean? Jalapeno. It's just a worse cherry bomb. Yeah, a whole lane is good, but like, Torchwood just does that. <laughs> I think you get a metal for like a starter pack, basically. Where is Torchwood? Do not own Stroppers. Okay, there are a lot of these guys I don't own. What the heck are all these things? I don't know what a few of these do. Blockly? Oh, I know what he does. I'm not gonna rate it. Holy crap. There are a lot here. I'm just gonna actually search through them. I want Meteor Flyer so bad though. That one's good. At least to me. I like watching the meteors rain down. So I'm putting away... I do own Cran Jelly. I'm putting away all the guys that I don't own. So that I can uh, hit the ones I do own. I think I own... Not Tumbleweed. Um, yeah, I think I own all of these. All right, that's good. Now let's move you up so that I don't have to do that again. All right, Colonel Pulp. Same as Cabbage. People, okay, E tier feels a little rough for Colonel and Cabbage. I'd move them both up to D. Yeah, yeah, that seems like a good play. I don't, I don't hate them. I don't love them either. I just think they're a little worse than all these guys. Kiwi Beast. D tier. Maybe C tier. Because it used to cost money. And I think I got it when it cost money. Five score years ago or so. A <laughs> hundred years ago. About like seven. Oh, no, eight. Yeah, it's a little crazy. I think so. Whenever it really came out, maybe 2017. Laser Bean. B tier. I don't use it, but I see where you're coming from. It is kind of good. Uh, Lava Guava. Instant D tier. So mid that it's kind of bad. I'm just gonna put pea shooter right next to cabbage because I don't. Yeah, pea pod is an E tier. Yeah, it's not that good, dude. Pea pod is like no, I think it's D tier. It's it's just as bad as pea shooter. Lightning read is C tier. C tier instantly. No second thoughts, dude. It is. It's not bad. It's not good though. Uh, I remember thinking it sucked, and I'm going to like it to it, because I've gotten it. Can't really rank Lily Pad. I see Tango Cup down there. You can't really rank that. It's just for water. Magnushroom. I love Magnushroom. I just wish I could say the same for... It's used. That's a C tier for me. Yeah, C tier. Maybe D tier. 
Yeah. Magnus Shroom is just not very useful. Magnifying Grass E tier sucks. Sucks Gorilla Boss. Melon Pole. B tier? It costs a bit. It costs a little bit. It is kind of good though. So B tier. Mistletoe? Same, same tier. No. Yeah. It's just a better banana. Honestly. Um, Moonflower? Really mid. Like, you need multiple for it to be good. So, yeah, it's right there. But it does boost Dust Clover, which is nice. Nightshade is F tier, dude. If you use Nightshade, you're on something. Because <laughs> it sucks so much. It is so bad. <laughs> Parsnip? What? Where should I put Parsnip? Um... I feel like a C tier is good for him. He's definitely better than Box Joy. But not by much. Peanut's an E tier. It's just kind of there. No one uses him. P line. Where should I put P line? I think it's a B tier. It boosts pea plants, like, for some reason, dandelion. But also torchwood, and that's really nice. Pepperbolt's an F tier. No one loves you, Pepperbolt. What does he cost, 175? Or is it 200? I think it's 200. Yeah, I haven't memorized him, because I never used him. Last time I used him was a conveyor belt level. Fat beat. Also E tier. Just like Peanut. No one uses you. It's kind of funny though. Perfume Shroom can't really rate it. Not F tier. Can't really rate that. Pakra. Oh, you already know. If you have Pakra, you know. It is the GOAT. <laughs> like, it is the best play in the game. All the way top of S tier. <laughs> Man, even how I'm rating it, I'm just putting it out the front. Um, uh, we did. Potato mine. Yeah, I think D tier is a good spot. Ain't that good? Way better options, such as chili bean. <laughs> I really can't really rank that. It is useful though. Uh, primal pea shooter, worst primal plant, still C tier. That should be saying something. I guess by a long shot the worst primal plant out of the four here. And it is still really good. Or not really good, but still good. Primal potato light, S tier. You go, yo, 50 sun for cherry bomb. <laughs> it takes like four seconds to boot up, bro. That is really good. Primal Sunflower, that is A tier. <laughs> I think it and Sunshroom are perfectly equal. Because Sunshroom costs 25 and it grows. So I'm going to put them both in A tier. Really good. <laughs> Primal Walnut, best wall in the game, still B tier. Actually, no, I feel like A tier. Yeah. Yeah. A tier. A tier feels good. A lot of health. Only 75 sun. Way cheaper than Tawnet. Or one sun cheaper than Tawnet. Whatever. Puffshin got nerfed from its last game. It's just like a C tier now that disappears. Pumpkin. Who uses pumpkin? D tier. Honestly. Alright, Red Stinger. Okay, Red Stinger, Repeater. Red Stinger is the same as Repeater. Both C tier. They're, they are better than Pea Shooter. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think these two are the same. I would use Red Stinger over Repeater, though. <laughs> Reinforcement, okay. Another, I think, A tier, and launches them all back a few squares. Every zombie. It's pretty nice, pretty nice. Thought, I thought I was missing something. Um, Spring Bean? I'll get to you in a minute. Roto Bag is an E tier, though. Diagonal shots, really? Really? Who uses it? Why would you use it? Just use like Fire Fisher or something. Oh, I do not own this. Oops. <laughs> um, Sap for you. It's a good staller. A or B? I don't use it, so B. It's a very good staller, though. Shadow Shroom. C. I don't really like it that much. I only use it when it's with Moonflower, really. It does poison, but like ailment is just better. Honestly, you know, Shrieking Violet. I also don't own this Cold Mint. Shrinking Violet is pretty good. If you're a nerd, <laughs> I don't like using it E tier. <laughs> Snappy. Okay, that's a that's an E tier. D tier. Better than Roto Baga. Not even better than Blue Moon. It does look sick though. <laughs> um Snapdragon. B tier? A tier? I say A tier. It's strong. It's good. Two by three. Really nice. Really nice. Snoopy. Same as the game before it. B tier. It's it's good. Solar tomato D tier. I don't even know why I own it. I just have it. Yeah, it's okay. Solar sage. Oh my gosh, bro! I love solar sage. I love it so much. It's so nice. 50 sun when you plant it. And it's free. And then when a zombie takes it, you get 100. And every few seconds, you get another 50. It's so good. It's so good. Spearman. No doubt. It's tier. Spawns a row of spike rocks. Speaking of spike rocks. B tier. It's almost spike weed, really. It's just cheaper. <laughs> no, that feels weird. C tier. Yeah, they're good, but like, you know, is Spike Rock even a plant? Like, everything else looks like a plant. Spike Rock is just a pile of rocks, though. Kind of weird. Split P, E tier, no reason to use it. Outside of the first few levels of Wild West. Spore Shroom, D tier, don't use it. It's okay, though. It ain't horrible, but I personally would use mostly everything else. Spring Bean F tier. No one uses it. No one loves it. It's bad. Squash. My good old squash. A tier. Just like last game. It's nice. It's real nice. Stalia. A or B? I'm thinking A. It's a nice stun. It's free. <laughs> pretty good. Pretty good. Um, Sticky Bomb Rice. Instant A tier just for Arena. But it's held back from S tier because I don't. It's not very useful outside of Arena. If you get what I'm trying to say here. Picking up what I'm putting down. 
Uh, Stunion 25 size, so it's B tier. If it was free though, it'd be very good. It'd be very good. Um, so. Sunbeam is F tier, as should be obvious. It's bad. Nothing else to say. Sunflower, really mid. I'd say C tier. It's more useful than P shooter. But I wouldn't use it. Sweet potato. Okay, sweet potato is E tier. <laughs> it's just a better version of garlic. Which isn't saying much, but it is just a better version. Tall nut. D tier, dude. Why would you use Taunet when Primal Walnut's right there? Like, I guess if you don't have Primal Walnut, you would use Taunet, but even then, I would use Endurian. Three Peter. Uh, D tier. I don't think I should explain myself on that. I don't think I need to. Time Warp. It is good. Teleports them all to the back of the lawn. That is nice. That is really nice. Maybe S tier? It does have a really long recharge, so no, A tier. Alright, tile turnip. That's gonna be a no for me, dog. Not F. My bad. No for me, dog is in. I'm not gonna read it. <laughs> Toadstool. Okay. Mixed feelings. This chomper, there it is. D tier. It is, eh? Yeah, it's not good. It's not bad. <laughs> um, Torchwood. Oh yeah, the strong one. The strong one. I'd say it's B tier. Is this still okay? Twin Sunflower. <laughs> it's bad. It's D tier. Also, I did not meet B tier. I'm at A tier for Twitchwood. I don't know why they buff them so much. Like, now zombies take damage when they eat it. And then it explodes like a jalapeno. And it has a lot of HP. <laughs> like, dang, okay. Old tomato. Old tomato. What would I do? Okay. B tier? People think it's good. I don't think it's good. They're that good. They do own it though. Walnut. C tier. Wasabi whip. C tier. I think I should move in Durian if I have Walnut and Infinite there. Yeah, B tier for Durian feels better. Um, Winter Melon. You know a good Winter Melon is in A tier. <laughs> These are all just one leg up above A tier. To me at least, to me at least. B tier with Hazel. It's not horrible. It's not very good either. I think it's good. Zoybean Pod. Honestly, Zoybean Pod? I don't know where I would put Zoybean Pod. I'm going to put it back. Crayon Jelly. I'll, I'll get to it in a second. Crayon Jelly. Okay, Crayon Jelly. The D. There's nothing much to say. Honestly, maybe even E. Yeah. It's not that good. I did level it up twice, though. Which is weird. Zoebean pod. Where would I put Zoebean pod? 
No, it's a C tier. It's a C tier. Yeah. Alright, this is my final list right here. And A means I don't really rate it because it's just not really applicable to rating. At least comparable to these guys. These ones I just don't use ever. And yeah, this is my final one. I will say though, out of all these, I am very close to getting Ice Bloom. Like five seed packets away. So, if I had to rate Ice Bloom, I would say it's a C tier. But I don't own it, so I'm going to put it back. But you don't unlock that modern new ones in that color. Whatever. Final rating. Here you go, guys. You're welcome. No one asked for this, but you're welcome anyway.